All right, I'm gonna show you how to depin an old style Honda coil plug from the OBD Zero series Hondas. This is the two pin plug. You got the black and yellow wire that are the uh, uh, battery voltage to the coil and the blue wire is just a coil state sensor, I believe. So to get these plugs out, or to get the pins out of these plugs, you have to first get a tool like what I have here, this is a, a depinning tool, but you could probably use a small flathead screwdriver to do the same thing. Because that's essentially what it is. You can kind of see it's just a real thin blade uh, screwdriver. So to get this out, the first thing you have to do is look at the back side of the plug and uh, pull this rubber grommet out. It's got several flutes on it, so it makes it kind of tricky to get out, but you just pry it as you can see and eventually it'll come uh, loose and you can slide it out that's just for water protection you want to keep that around because uh, the back side of the plug won't be watertight if you don't uh, don't put that grommet back in then that exposes the back side of the wire clips um, and if you look down the inside of the the cannon plug there I don't know if we can see that but uh, inside there there are some clips that hold the spade connectors in. So what you have to do is take your screwdriver or your depinning tool again and you stick it in the, the inside portion of the clip pretty far in to depress the plastic, uh, plastic latch and it's pretty much right down the center of the pin and once you depress that plastic latch far enough the, pin, the, the connector should just slide right out. Let me try and get on there. There we go. So let me show you the inside of that again. Um, now that the spade is out, you can see that the uh, inside of the connector kind of hooks into the back part of the spade clip to hold it in place. And so if you ever have a loose clip, just pushing it in a little farther to engage the plastic clip on the back of the spade connector will uh, will uh, fix it from backing out. Now this uh, coil power wire is quite a bit larger gauge um, so it's a little bit trickier to get out there's less space but uh, that one came out pretty easily so now what you're left with is a uh, the cannon plug that's empty and hopefully you can kind of see on the inside there the little uh, plastic connectors that hold in the spade clip. So that's all I got. Thanks.